Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 25 of the Adobe Animate tutorial series. So in the last lesson we took a look at the movie clip symbol and in this lesson we are going to take a look at the graphic symbol right here. So for the graphic symbol I'm going to drag another uh, square box right here and let's test the movie out here. So let's go to control and test the scene right here and you can see that the movie clip symbol actually rolls out like that. And for this one, I'm going to right click, convert this into symbol and convert this into a graphic symbol right here. So let me just press OK and double click it. And you see that it also has an independent timeline. So let's insert a keyframe right here, move this to the side. Let's insert another keyframe right here and move this to the side as well. Insert another keyframe, move this to the side. Insert another keyframe, move this to the side. Insert another keyframe, move this to the side, and insert another keyframe and move this to the side. And let me go back and let's test out the movie over here. So now uh, let's go to controls and test scene right here. And you can see that only the main movie clip symbol moves and the graphic symbol does not move. It's because the graphic symbol is dependent on the main timeline right here. So let me just insert uh, around four keyframes right here. So insert frame right there. And let's see, you can see that the uh, graphic symbol actually moves and the movie clip is actually independent. So if I were to go into, uh, so I have four frames right here. And if I were to go into my controls and test the movie right here, uh, test the scene right here, what happens is that it only animates four frames according to the main timeline. So if I were to add in uh, more frames right here. You can see that the whole animation is actually working right there. Insert, uh, I'll just drag the keyframe out here. And you can see that the animation depends on the main timeline. So let me just go to uh, controls again and test out the scene. And you can see that the animation happens and both the graphics and the movie clip animation works. But this one, the graphic symbol is actually dependent on the main timeline. So it'll actually just animate if <clears throat> uh, this main timeline is set to loop. So if I were to stop the main timeline, it won't work. So for this, we'll be using action script. So uh, I'm going to create a new layer for that. We'll be learning about action script in new lessons. So let me just uh, go to insert keyframe right here and then go to actions. All right, right click. Okay, it is loading. Okay. So now I'm just going to press stop, open bracket, close and close it down there. So I just added in an action script. So now what will happen is that after uh, 32 frames, this movie clip symbol, uh, this graphic symbol will stop. So you can go to windows right here. Sorry, go to uh, c control and test scene. And now it's going to generate a file and you can see that this symbol actually stops after 35 frames of animation because it is dependent on the main timeline. So I didn't add in the action strip inside uh, the graphic symbol, but inside the main timeline. And you can see that this stops right after the animation reaches here. So this is how movie clips um, and graphic symbol are different. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.